Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and we are back in Undertale. Um, so I've looked it up. I looked it in the wiki. I looked in the web pages and videos and everything, and, and there is no possible way to get the pacifist ending, the true pacifist, without killing Asgore. At the very end. You have to go through it the like the first time and defeat him non-passively. Like you have to get a normal ending, otherwise the other events do not trigger. So that's something I don't want to do. Alright, he's gonna Oh, I went the wrong direction, didn't I? This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped here underground. If by any chance you have any unfinished businesses, I do! I do! Please do what you must. Okay, so. Continue. Go back. I see. Anything you want to do is important enough. Even something as small as reading a book or taking a walk. Please take your time. Okay, so they. They know. I think I think they know. They know that we need to complete some things before we actually go and do this. Um, first things first is we need to go back and um, we need to friend and date Undyne. So let's go back that direction. And I don't know how long this is going to take. I don't even know if this is going to be. This might be a, like a full episode of just me walking to try and find stuff. Oh, we can take elevators. Yay. Hello. That was easy. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We gotta go. Okay, there we go. Um, so I don't exactly know where I'm going to. But I know it's back this way. I should probably pull up a um, a map of some kind, just so I know where I'm going. Okay, maybe not. Okay, it's it's not taking us that long. That's good, right? Am I going the right way? What's over here? Um. Okay. Hold on. I gotta. I gotta pull up a map. Um. Let's do. Hello, Code Prime Eight. Hello. <laughs> Undertale. I was not expecting my uh, Roblox Plus to talk to me. Under Undertale full map. All right. Let's go. Over here. That's a good one, right? Uh, okay. There's New Home. There, there's Hotland. <clears throat> okay, that's not where I need to go. What is that? That's not it. Okay, where does that lead to? Where's Undyne's house? It's not in the Hotlands, is it? Hold on. Oh gosh, oh gosh, okay. There we got, oh, oh, I got a long ways to travel back. Oh geez, okay. Um, hmm. Is the boatman around here anywhere? No. Okay. Trying to look, trying to look, trying to look. <clears throat> okay, I just I just have to travel, you know, and hopefully we can have some nostalgia going all the way back. <laughs> um, right floor one. 
I think that's... Oh, come on, come on. Oh yeah, that's, that's way back there. <clears throat> it's the first elevator that we're in. My apologies, I did not think it was going to be this far of a trip to go all the way back, but apparently we've we've done a lot of travel. Oh gosh, <laughs> the mouse was in the way. Wait, how do I get back? There. What? Wait, how am I supposed to get back over there? Where's the boatman at? Um, boatman. Where are you? We're at the core. Okay. Wait, what's that over there? What is that stuff? Hmm. <clears throat> okay, so I'll show you what I'm looking at real quick. Um, just for reference, that way you guys can see. So I walked all the way back to, where did I go? No, that's not it. That's not it either. Okay, so I walked back to here. Control zero. And we'll zoom out. So I'm all the way back to this point, but right there's what I want. Left floor one. Left floor one will get me all the way back to here. Okay, so I need to travel back. Back, 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 back. Boop a doop, boop a doop a doop, boop. Boop a doop a doop a doop. Mass is in the way. Mass is in the way. Oh, oh, oh. Sorry, you guys can't see it. There we go. All right. Now we're back. So I need to go to left floor one, and that should take us far enough back. <sighs> I think. All right. Left floor one. Doop -a doom. Boop -a doop -a doom. Get the mouse out of the way. Boatman. Hey, Mr. Boatman. Care for a ride? Yes. <clears throat> Where are we going to? We're heading to the waterfall. I think. Is that where we need to go? Okay, if we get in that one. And then uh, let's kill that. Go to the waterfall area. Hmm. On. Okay, there's that. Now where's the waterfall? Okay. Okay, cool. So, Tim Village is a room before the dark and lantern room. Oh, we've gotten that tip before. <clears throat> okay, so, here we go. Now... Come again sometime. Woof woof. Tra la la. I think I think they're dogs in costume. This way. Then up through here. Hello, papyrus. Oh ho! The human arrives. Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? I have a plan to make you great you two great friends. Uh will you hang out? Yes. Okay. Stand behind me. Make sure you give her this. She loves these. What was it? Wait, do, do I have room in my inventory? Hi, Papyrus. Ready for your extra private one-on-one -on -one training? You bet I am. And I brought a friend. Hi, I don't think we've...
why don't you two come in? <laughs> he spun in circles. He's like, eee! Here, Undyne. My friend brought you a gift for you on their own. Uh, thanks. I'll, uh, put it in with the others. <laughs> There's like a ton of them. So, are we ready to start? Oopsie doopsie, I just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. You two have fun. <laughs> okay, that was worth it. This entire episode, that was the best right there. So why are you here? To rub your victory in my face? To humiliate me? <clears throat> Sorry, I'm sounding very mannish. To humiliate me even further? Is that it? No. Then why are you here? Wait, I get it. You think I'm going to be friends with you, huh? Right? Yes. Really? <laughs> How delightful. I accept. Let's all frolic in the fields of friendship. Not. Why would I ever be friends with you? Hmm. If you weren't my uh, house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. You will never, uh, I will never be your friend. Now get out of my house. <laughs> Dang it. What a shame. I thought Undyne could be friends with you. But I guess I overestimated her. She's just not up for the challenge. Challenge? What? Papyrus, wait a second. Darn it. <laughs> he thinks I can't be friends with you. <laughs> what a joke. I could make friends with a wimpy loser like you any day. I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not just going to be friends. We're going to be besties. I'll make you like me so much, you won't be able to think of anyone else. <laughs> It's the perfect revenge. <laughs> Why don't you have a seat? How, how do I? Hold on. Sit down and progress? Yes. Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. All set. What would you like? Hey, don't get up. You're the guest. Sit down and enjoy yourself. <laughs> um, why don't you just point to what you want? I can take... Uh, uh, you can use this spear. Um, Alright, okay. Use the arrows. And then point. Okay. Hot, okay, hold on. Let's go all the way to the left. Undyne. Undyne with Z. Uh, sugar goes in T. Wait, sugar goes in T. Select with Z. Um, sickly yellow liquid. Soda, sickly li yellow liquid. Hot chocolate, green cylinder. T box, um, blatantly. Blatantly correct choice. <laughs> Fridge full of food. Or a sword acquired taste. <laughs> Alright. So I really like hot chocolate. But the tea is the blatantly correct choice. Tea, huh? Coming right up. Whoa, 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 move, move the soda off. It'll take a moment for the water to boil. <laughs> there it goes. Okay, it's all done. Sugar? Yes. Here we are. Careful, it's hot. I can't move or do anything. 
It's not that hot. Just drink it already. You take a sip of the tea. It's burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, right? Nothing but the best for my absolute precious friend. This feels very forced. It's just it's a li little uncomfortable, that's all. Hey, you know, it's kind of strange that... Strange you choose that tea. Golden flower tea. That's Asgore's favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, you kind of remind me of him. You're both total weenies. Sort of. <laughs> Am I still holding on to the thing? You know, I was a pretty hot-headed kid. Once I... To prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you want to n know how to beat me? I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. One day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad, but he was beaming. I had never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me, and now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. So I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight. Like, um, Papyrus. <laughs> <laughs> Papyrus is a dork. But, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can ever let Papyrus into the Royal Guard. Don't tell him I said that. He's just, well... I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty, pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's... He's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you. And he ended up being friends with you instead. I could never send him into battle. He'd get ripped into little smi smiling shreds. <laughs> That's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, you know? So, um, maybe can do something else with it. Maybe he can do something else with his life. Oh, uh, sorry. I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? Well, I'll get some more. Wait a second. Papyrus. His cooking lessons. He was supposed to have that right now. And if he's not here to have it, you'll have to have it for him. We're gonna cook! Yes! To the kitchen! That's right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking. Which means that if I give this, his lesson, his lesson give you his lessons, we will become closer than you can ever imagine. Wahaha! <laughs> Afraid? You're going to be the best. We're going to be best friends. <laughs> it's, it's such a triumph in the kitchen. I love it. Let's start with the sauce. Boom. Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. <laughs> My greatest enemy is... Vegetables. <laughs> now, pound them to dust with your fist. How will you pound them? Strong or wimpy? Strong! You punch the vegetables with full force. You knock over a tomato. Yeah, yeah! Our hearts are uniting against these healthy ingredients. Now it's my turn. No. <laughs> what in the world? Uh, we'll just scrap this into a bowl later. But for now, we add noodles. Homemade noodles are the best. But I just buy store brand. <laughs> They're the cheapest. <laughs> uh, just put them into the pot. How will you put them into the pot? Fear, fiercefully or carefully? Fiercefully! Fiercely! I throw everything into the pot as hard as I can, including the box! It clanks against the empty bottom. Yeah! 
<laughs> All right, now it's time to stir the pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it. Press Z to repeatedly stir. <laughs> stir harder. <laughs> oh, the most epic battle in the entire game right now. Oh, let me do it. <laughs> Oh, that's the stuff. All right, now for the final step. Turn up the heat. Let the stovetop symbolize your passion. Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire. Ready? Don't hold anything back. Hold right to turn up the heat. I'm holding the right. I'm holding the right. Hotter. You can do this. Hotter. Go higher. Hotter. Wait, that's too... What just happened? Ah, uh, man, no wonder Papyrus sucks at cooking. I can't move around. So what's next? Scrapbooking? Friendship bracelets? <laughs> oh, who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel that way about me, and if we can't be friends, that's okay. Because we're not fr if we're not friends, it means we can destroy you without regret. It means I can destroy you without regret. I've been defeated. My house is in shambles. No, I can't move. I even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. All out on both sides. It's the only way to regain my lost pride. Now come on. Hit me with all you got. Nah. Undyne is letting you make the first attack. Uh, fake attack. You pretend to swing at Undyne with all your might. <laughs> What? That's the best you can manage? Even attacking at full force, you just can't muster any intent to hurt me, huh? Heh. <laughs> you know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first, I hated you, your stupid. I don't. I, don't, I can't. I can't pronounce it. Oh no. Stick. <laughs> Stick. There we go. But the way that you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. And now you aren't just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Just like him. Listen, human. It seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight, but knowing him, he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually, some mean human will fall down here, and I'll take their soul instead. That makes sense, right? Foo, foo, foo. Oh, and if you do hurt Asgore, I'll take the human soul's I'll take the human souls across the barrier and beat the heck out of you. That's what friends are for, right? Foo foo foo. Now let's get the heck out of this flaming house. Oh, well, that's fun, huh? Well, have to hang out another time. <laughs> but uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I guess I'll go back to hanging go back I guess I'll go hang with Papyrus so if you need me drop by Snowden okay oh and if you ever need help just give Papyrus a ring okay since we're in the same spot I'll be able to talk to you too <clears throat> well see you later punk okay so that's that's that sounds like only fire lives here now <laughs> okay I had a hidden key a key of some sort, right? Let's check. It's locked. 
it's locked. Okay, um... Items. Okay, hold on, hold on. Uh, no, let's go back and sell dimensional box. <clears throat> Mystery key. There we go. Okay. It's locked. It's still locked. Okay, do I need to exit and come back? Hold on. No, I got the key on me now. Uh, I can put away the worn dagger and the heart locket. Because that failed us last time. It's locked. It's still locked. Okay. So, uh, we've only got six minutes left, or no, we're four minutes left. Uh, calm and tranquility, fill you with determination. I will find out what I need to do next, um, and probably go that, that route or that direction. Hold on. I'm definitely looking up the next step. Um, let's see here. There's a bunch of walking around. I'm glad we got to do the fight, though. You know what? I will. I'll, I will leave it right here for now. I will look up what to do next, and I want to make sure that I get all the steps completed before I go and, and have to fight Asgore for the last time. Or for the first time. Because you... This game takes into account the times that you've saved. Like, saving the game after you've defeated Asgore is one of the steps to take to completing the true pacifist. So it's, it's like, not only, like, taking a mechanic of a game that is a normal part of everyday games and placing that as part of the game is just a brilliant idea. So, thank you everyone for watching this episode of Undertale with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end, and it's really your choice if you want to do so or not. Love you guys very much, have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. Outro.